Good afternoon, everyone, um, family. It feels like the family is here, and guests. Um, welcome to the 2014 Lullaby Celebration Concert. Today, we're going to hear a selection of lullabies that were created throughout the past eight months by soon-to-be new, experienced young parents, mothers, young mothers, and young fathers. So over 50 women and some of their partners and 25 artists wrote lullabies as part of Carnegie Hall's Musical Connections program. Projects happened here in New York City, in homeless shelters, in hospitals, at the Rose M. Singer Correctional Facility on Rikers Island, in four locations across the country as well. And we welcome our national partners here today. So welcome from Austin, Seattle, from Maine, and from Chicago. So all of you welcome today. Um, many of the women that wrote these lullabies, that we wrote them, you know, wrote them together, um, they could not be with us today. So we'd like to take a moment to acknowledge their contributions to today's concert and acknowledge all of the participants and their babies who are here today. Won't you please stand up, all the participants, anybody who wrote a lullaby, really over the last three years, anybody who wrote a lullaby, welcome. Yes, of course. So today we come together to celebrate the songs and the stories of Lullaby, to hear the hopes and dreams, exactly, exactly. Um, the hopes and dreams for children, to hear what lullabies have meant to participants and what they can mean for us all. Saskia Lane. <laughs> 